Hello and welcome. Tonight's video is rest in Asha. Asha is heaven on earth. It's inspired by the Magi text. If you're interested, I'll leave a link in the drop down description. Enjoy, love you. When you realize you come from good spirit and you're made of good spirit, and shall return to good spirit. Your frequency rises and you become a mighty spiritual force creating in the plastic medium of energy. Asha, I am God's thought. I live in God's idea, perfection. The whole universe vibrates with expectant energy for God is with child. And all throughout the celestial palace, the prospect of ever expanding good radiates brilliant and bright with joy as the highest principle of good shines the light of observance on the dark waves. That is the plastic medium of creation and in conformity to law, the wise Lord's highest desire is focused into form, young, timeless, and beneficial to all. Know only good. Perceive and understand only the good and let your experience and practice be the same. Be aware at all times of your high standing Always remember the covenant that's written on your mind that you may never forget you are a child of the King. I have the mind of Christ and my only job is to align with and hold continuously in mind the attributes of God, love, life, peace, joy, power, and freedom, and to be those attributes. My mind is God, but my thoughts are not always God. I pray that my thoughts align with God mind. Believe only the highest truth and enter Asha. As the wise Lord is perfect, so his idea of creation is perfect. This is called Asha, capital T Truth. And this idea of truth is the very spirit of God. It is the true vision of God's ideal existence. It is the real above all real the highest truth, creation in perfect harmony, where nothing occurs at the expense or harm of another. I look inward to the God mind and I see truth and I experience soundness of mind. Thoughts make your world, beliefs make your thoughts, reason makes your beliefs, Mind reasons. Mind is the reason. Know this, then the illusion goes away. Belief in only good, it is this complete trust that brings out manifestations now, real as they already are, by means of reason. Resonance. I know being grateful will bring more things to be grateful for. I'm grateful for life. I'm grateful for love. I'm grateful for family. And I'm grateful for friends. I'm grateful for protection. I'm grateful for provision. I'm grateful for peace. I'm grateful for joy. I'm grateful for I live in this, I live in God, my good. The 
perfect creators, perfect mind, created a perfect thought. I am that thought. I am perfect spirit. I choose not to be double-minded. I choose to think God and not the lie. I am perfect spirit, God's child, God's thought, and spirit makes form. Therefore, my body is perfect. My world is perfect. On a subconscious level, I live in truth, and the lie of discord disappears. The spell of separation is broken, for in truth, all is good. All is God. I am awakened to who I am. I am light, and in light there is no darkness. This frequency, this thought, this word, this spirit that I hold is the key to the kingdom, and this wisdom rules both worlds. I've spent too long looking outside of myself, looking for meaning, purpose, affirmation, approval, love, truth, happiness, and even God, just to find myself ever searching. So I quiet all the many thoughts and ideas and stories, and I go inside my heart of hearts, and there I see Jesus. And I realize there is no separation from my good, my God. We are one. All the truth, all the happiness I've been looking for, it's here right now, for I am that. And now that I know this, it is. Good is, God is, Asha is. The original word is all good comes from the Creator, and no evil comes from Him. From this original Word, the spiritual world is made straight, and the material world is brought into order. I live in God, and God is good, and God is omnipresent. That means my good is omnipresent. My God is here now. My good is here now. Giving true witness, a man will be saved. Only think and speak truth to yourself, and it will form. Think God's highest idea of truth, Asha, and live. Keep the power of truth in mind. Make it your model. Trust God, and you'll see it already is. You don't need to worry or strive to make something happen. You don't have to force it. Just align with the truth. Everyone who is of the truth hears the truth, holds the truth. Because when man sins or thinks or speaks in error and sin, it's against his nature, for he comes from the good spirit and he will return to the good spirit. God put the good mind, the divine spark in all of his creatures, so it has a guide home. It's how the seed knows to climb out of the ground and become a plant, how the planets stay their course, and how man will find his way home to Asha, truth. And living in truth, it's life without enemies. For the evil, the lie, the illusion is rendered nothing. So go Ashavan truth knower in truth and enjoy this wonderful life knowing you are God's thought living in God's idea Asha perfection